Hi, this is Rachel from TLC Inspirations and today we're going to work on back loop only and that is abbreviated BLO in a crochet pattern, ridges in your crochet. And here are three examples. Um, this one here is single crochet, this one here is half double crochet, and this one here is double crochet. And you can see the difference in the height um, in each swatch. Single crochet is going to have more ridges because they are smaller. The reason we use back loops only or front loops only is to create this ridge which as you can see creates a significant amount of stretch. And this compared to the half double crochet they're just wider, they're taller, the stitches themselves are taller so the ridges are going to be further apart. So it's not going to have, it's still going to have stretch, but it's not going to have as much stretch as the single crochet. Same goes for the double. Each one of these on either side of this, I don't know if you can see, I mean it's a ridge so it's slightly raised. Okay, now I'm just going to show you how to work in the back loop only. We already know that this, you see where my hook is, this is our V. Because when you look at it this way, it's a V. Okay. So that's both loops. This is the front loop and this is the back loop. So when a pattern says that you are going to work in back loops only, it's talking about this loop right here. We're going to do our regular single crochet, but we're going to do it in the back loops only. Normally I would go under both loops, but not in this case. Okay, so all I'm going to do is go through that, go under that back loop, yarn over, Turn over again and pull through. All I've done is my regular single crochet. The only change I've made is instead of going under both loops, I'm only going through this back loop. Let's do it again. See that? That's all we're doing. And the row I'm working on is this, from this ridge up. So it's all this right here. Okay, I'm going to dig down for that final stitch. Okay. And we just finished our single crochet row in back loops only. And that is just how easy it is. And this same process is used in all these basic stitches. So single crochet, half double crochet, double crochet, even the triple crochet, and several others will work. Anything that has this V across the top when you're done, you can do back loop only or you can do front loop only. We're not going to do front loop only today but you get the idea. If this is back loop only, then front loop only is going to be the opposite, the one closest to you. So it's as easy as that and it's a really great tool. This type of stitch is really useful for things that require extra stretch. So think fingerless gloves like around the band, um, hat bands, um, anywhere that you want to add texture or interest. It also doesn't have to be functional. It can just be design wise, be nicer. Um, so there's a lot of uses for it and I'm sure you'll find it um, a lot when you start getting into the different patterns. Anyways, I want to thank you for watching and we'll see you on the next video.